Welcome everyone. I recently watched this video from Brian's Logic. He said something in it that I just had to leave a comment about. And Brian replied back. But I will get to that later in the video. Now, I am no science or math person, but neither is Brian, as far as I know, so I will do my best to respond the best way I know how. If I get anything wrong, please feel free to leave a comment. I am always willing to learn. Okay, let's get to it. Well, how are you doing? <clears throat> There's going to be a quick video uh, titled New Moon Shadow. Okay, now... <clears throat> This here is the moon. I photographed this myself, right? I zoomed into here to photograph it. That I can zoom that far. Um, this is the moon during full moon. Um, uh, obviously, I have the top of this photo cut off. But this is the moon during full moon. So this is what the moon is. This is what it looks like. Now we're told that this is a physical object. This was claimed in the heliocentric model the, uh, to be a physical object. We're told that it's a rock in the sky and that it's lit by the sun. Yes, Brian, it is a physical object that reflects the sun's light. 3% to 12% of the sun's light, by the way. But there are no claims to that because claims are assertions made with no evidence to back them up. There is, however, actual evidence to show the moon is what we know it is. Okay, this is what the claim is. Okay, so <clears throat> here is, first from space.com, right? New moon, right? We're, we're told we can't see it because it's daytime and all the light from the sun is at, at the far side of the moon. So the side, the face this, that we see, um, we're told, is uh, not lit by the sun and it's daytime so we can't see it. This is what we're told, right? So just to move on to the next one, uh, same again. Here is the full moon here. Here's the new moon here. So the side that's facing, the, the this is claimed to be the earth. Um, the side that's facing the earth is dark and the earth is bright because it's in daylight and all the light is at the other side of the moon, right? This is the claim. No, that's reality. But please, do go on. Third one, right? Same again. There's the new moon. All dark at, at the earth-facing side with the earth here that's claimed to be the earth. Um, um, and it's it's on the day, it's in day, daylight here at this side. Um... There is the moon, and all of it is at the back of it, right? So, same all the way. These are all from official uh, sites. Uh, same again here. Uh, obviously, none of this is flat out, obviously. <clears throat> New moon, right? There is uh, there is the claimed earth. Here is, the, here is the moon. Here is the sun. And nothing, right? Same on the other side. New moon, nothing. Okay. No, not nothing. The sun's light and our atmosphere make it so we can't see it from here on Earth. So, right, this is the claim that we don't see the moon because it's daytime. Now, even though I could, I could argue against that, easy, I could destroy that easy. Uh, it does no need to because uh, this video was specific. So, all the light is at the back of this moon that's claimed to be a, a solid object. And the light is coming from the sun that's claimed to light up the moon. And it's daytime on Earth, so... It's claimed that we don't see the moon uh, in new moon because it's daytime and all the light is at the back of the moon, right? So next one, same again. Here is all the sunlight supposed to be coming in parallel, right? Here's the globe out. Uh, here is the moon, right? New moon phase. All dark at this side, right at the opposite side. Here is daylight on the globe out, right? This is what they're trying to claim. Same again here. All the parallel light from the sun that they claim happens, right? Uh, there is uh, the bright side of the moon. It's facing away from the. This is claimed to be out, and this is claimed to be daytime. And this is the new moon here, right? Um. So, this is the problem. I don't know if other people have asked this or what the story is, but if the moon is a physical object and it's in the sky and it's there during daytime, right? This new moon. Right, and all the light, and it's being lit by the sun, and all the light is at the back of the moon. Right, the, I don't know if the moon has a back, but they're claiming it does. I don't know what the hell the moon is. Then, where is the shadow that should be cast onto the earth? 
the moon is not directly between the earth and the sun though the moon is on the same earth latitude as the sun it is off by a few degrees so we don't get a shadow that only happens during eclipses oh and as far as the moon having a back this video shows it and the Chinese rover Yatu-2 has been exploring it since 2019. Regardless of what you think the Earth is, where is the shadow? Where is the shadow that should turn up somewhere? There should be a shadow somewhere. If the new moon has all the light at the back of it, there should be a shadow on the surface of Earth. Flat or globe, there should be a shadow. If the sun is lighting the moon and the moon is a physical object and during new moon times, the... Uh, the moon is in the sky um, and the sun is all, light is all at the back of the moon, then there should be a shadow somewhere on Earth. If there were a shadow on the surface of the Earth, that would mean there would be a solar eclipse every 28 days or so. Only Sleeping Warrior claims that happens, but we don't see it because it happens over water. Planes should fly past the shadow or through the shadow. There should be something. Right. So this is my modest holdings on this. <clears throat> right. I don't know if other people ask the question, but this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to put, stick my neck out a bit. Right. New, uh, <clears throat> new moon shadow modest holdings. If P, the moon is a physical object that is lit by the sun, then Q, we will observe a new moon cast. Sorry, I'm sorry. I'll start that again. Sorry. If P, the moon is a physical object that is lit by the sun, then Q, we will observe a moon shadow cast upon the surface of Earth during new moon time. Not Q, we do not observe a, ca a shadow cast upon the surface of Earth during new moon time. So therefore not P, the moon is not a physical object that is lit by the sun. So one more time, new moon shadow modest tolerance. If P, the moon is a physical object that is lit by the sun, then Q, we will observe a moon shadow cast upon the surface of Earth during new moon time. Not Q, we do not observe a shadow cast upon the surface of Earth during new moon time. So therefore not P, the moon is not a physical object that is lit by the sun. Because if it was, then we would see a shadow, right? Flat or globe, there would be a shadow. So I don't care what you think the earth is, right? If this is a physical object and this is light behind it, right? Then there, are going, there is going to be a shadow somewhere. Even if it's an angled shadow want to somewhere, doesn't matter, there is going to be a shadow. Because the whole point is that we were told we can't see the new moon, right? Now, besides, I could destroy that argument other ways. But the point is, is if the claim is that we can't see it because it's daytime and all the light is at the back of it, then where is the shadow? There has to be a shadow. There has to be a shadow. There was no way around that. It has to be cast somewhere. It has to be some kind of a shadow. Where is this shadow? It should be on the surf surface of the earth. It's not there. And before anyone wants to bring up, this is important, listen to this now, for all the fools on the opposition side, before anyone wants to bring up solar eclipses, right? This is new moon, right? Not solar eclipses. This is specifically about new moon. For there to be a shadow on the earth, the sun has to be directly behind the moon, as with a solar eclipse, which we will see two of this year. However, the moon is a few degrees off from the sun, so no shadow will ever be cast on the surface of the earth. This is what goes in front of the sun during a solar eclipse. This is not the moon. I don't know what it is, but it is not the moon. Okay, so before any of our opposition start wanting to tell me in comments or send me videos of solar eclipses, this is what goes in front of the sun during the solar eclipse. This is not the moon. If that is not the moon, but a filtered out image of the original image, whatever that is, like you told me in your comment section, then you are being willfully dishonest to suit your narrative. But that is not surprising since you got a light of flurf. Get it into your heads. This is not the moon. I don't know what it is, but it's not the moon. Okay? Solar eclipses are not caused by the moon going into in front of the sun during new moon time. Are you sure about that? 
Here are the dates of the two solar eclipses this year. Here are the dates of the new moons for this year. Oh my God, look, they are the same. There is no evidence that I can find that new moon is in the sky, that this physical new moon is in the sky. And there is evidence that it's not the moon going in front of the sun. And here it is. Here what is. You claim, and I quote, incorrect. That's a filtered image from the original image. I have many versions and none of them show the moon. Yet you claim you don't know what this is. And whatever it is, is not in front of the sun. So this really isn't evidence of anything. Oh, by the way, Brian, I found some images of the new moon that you might find interesting. And two articles about photographing the thinnest crescent moon as well. Just so, uh, sorry. Um, I just cut off. I'll just get away with that thing. Right. Let's adjust the levels a little bit on this. Brighten it up. Brighten it up. Where is the moon? Where is Mooney? That's not the moon. Are you really trying to adjust the filters on a filtered image? Seriously, Brian, give it up already. The cat is out of the bag and there is no way you can get it back in. That is what is in front of the sun during new moon. Or sorry, during solar eclipse. That is not the moon. Change it around all you want. That is not the moon. Okay? That is not the moon. End of story. That's the moon. Whatever that is. So, looking forward to feedback. Try and keep it on point i don't want to hear about other things i don't want to hear about how do you do this or that on flat earth i don't want to hear any rubbish i want you to keep it on point prove there's a shadow show the shadow or else relinquish your claim very simple thank you there you go brian there's the moon with all its phases including new moon and its wobble you can chase your elusive new moon shadow till the cows come home but you will never find it because it doesn't exist. How anyone can deny this is beyond belief. This is absolutely amazing. Thank you for watching. You are all awesome. See you in the next video.